Seasons is a scientific component that's important for our students to learn at an early age. We live in Kansas and we're lucky enough to have all four seasons. We get a wonderful fall, nice cool winters, spring and summers. Four seasons. On my calendar, I have a seasons pocket. So it's always nice to look outside to talk about when the seasons change. I have four cards. We have the winter card, which is signifying snow and cold. The spring card, signifying rain and the regrowth of the earth. Summer, good time to go to the beach, go swimming, no school, have fun. Fall, those leaves are dying and falling off of the trees. Reality, okay, the leaves fall down so that the trees can get ready for winter. I read a book, lots of books that connect to the seasons. This book is one of my favorites because it shows what happens to the trees during the different seasons. So in spring, our leaves are coming back fresh and new. In summer, the, le the trees are full of green live leaves. In the fall, those leaves begin to change colors and fall off the tree so that the tree is ready for winter. I also have books that give more and more pictures of the different seasons, our winter, our summer, our spring, and our fall. It's very important that the kids give a name to each of the seasons and know what season we're currently in. Even though it might feel warm, it won't be spring until March, or it won't be summer until June, it won't be fall until September, and it won't be winter until December. Side note, a quick piece of realia or manipulative that you can make for the kids to help them connect to the seasons, especially if you live in a place where the seasons aren't as consistent as Kansas. I took four water bottles, mini ones, just bought at the local store or in your recycling bin or after you use them. They can be of any size. I filled this one with water and put a little bit of blue dye in and I stuffed a yellow pom-pom in there. And my children know that the summers are sunny. So this represents the summer. After summer comes the season of fall. I filled this water bottle with water and I put leaves at the bottom and when they turn it, the leaves fall down, signifying fall or autumn. After autumn comes winter. I stuff some pom-poms in there with little glitters on there, water again, to represent snow and ice in the winter. Then in the spring, that snow and ice turns to rain. So I just put water in here with blue dye to signify the rain of spring for that rebirth. Seasons are a fun way to introduce new weather concepts and the time of the year in our science. Thank you.